Let's shift gears a little bit and go to a lightning round. A little lighter side questions. Uh, we'll ask you each to try and keep your answers to 15 seconds. We'll start with Kate Knuth this time. Each of you will get the same question. And the first question is, we assume each of you will vote for yourself in the city's ranked choice voting. In 15 seconds, who would you rank second and third and why? You know, last week, Sheila Nijad and I um, helped bring ranked choice voting clarity to our supporters. And we're both planning to rank each other um, second after voting for ourselves first. And I want to also encourage people to clearly rank a third choice in their ballot. And I think Mayor Fry has not earned a second term. All right. Kate Knuth, uh, thank you so much for your answer. Let's go to Mayor Fry. Thank you. Like uh, many Minneapolis residents throughout the city, I'm still evaluating my second and third choices, uh, so I have not made that decision yet. You've had a lot of time to evaluate the second and third choices. No second or third choices yet? Nope, not yet. Uh, but certainly I'll be making those prior to my visit to the ballot box. Very well. All right, Mr. Awed, who are your second and third choices? Uh, I think I've already been on the record to say that, you know, I could in good in conscience probably rank others. Um, and uh, along the same lines as uh, Mayor Fry, um, I haven't really decided yet, um, but I'm pretty confident that I'm probably going to rank all myself one on, on the ballot there. All right. Thank you so much. And Sheila Najad, the same question for you. Who would you rank second and third? Absolutely. Thanks for this question. I'm a coalition builder, so I have been thinking about this for a long time. And I'm ranking Kate Knuth second, and I encourage my supporters to do the same and look for a consistent candidate who's been um, in this for a while for your third place. Encourage everyone to do their research and remember that you can vote all across the board. All right, thank you very much for that answer. All right, we're going to our second question. What is your favorite Minneapolis park outside of your own neighborhood and why? Let's start with Kate Knuth again. Oh, this is such a great question. We have so many great parks. You know, I love um, to be along the river. I used to live near the river. I don't live there anymore. I live over in Bryn Mawr and I love to just walk and ride along the river that makes us such a dynamic, beautiful place to live. Mayor Fry. My favorite continues to be the Mississippi Riverfront. Uh, and obviously that stretches through a number of different neighborhoods through our city. Uh, it's a national park. It, it is recognized worldwide. Um, and I just love to go for a run along the shores. And Mr. Awed, what is your favorite park outside of your own neighborhood? Uh, I would probably have to say to get a sense of home, I love going to Curry Park. Um, it's always uh, great nostalgia there. Um, so I would probably say Curry Park. All right. Thank you for that answer. And Sheila Najad, your favorite park outside of your own neighborhood. This is an easy one for me. Falwell Park on the north side. You've got a great playground, you've got a splash pool, you've got great trees. I love it there. All right, thank you so much. Now go, we'll go to our third question. What is your favorite sculpture at the Walker Minneapolis Sculpture Garden? Kate Knuth? Oh, this is such a great question. My daughter, the sculpture garden is in between our home and where our daughter goes to school. And so um, it's actually kind of one of her playgrounds. And I, um, I love a lot of the sculptures. I'm really excited to see uh, the new one by Angela Tus uh, by the indigenous artist. And, uh, but I have to say, Aaron Spengler is a friend of my brother and my family, and I really love to go and see one of his works at the, at the Sculpture Garden. All right, thank you so much. Uh, Mr. Fry, Mayor Fry. I like the blue rooster. <laughs> All right, that was a quick answer. AJ Awed, what is your favorite sculpture at the Minneapolis, Minneapolis Sculpture Garden? Yeah, I would have to probably agree with the uh, current mayor there. <laughs> the rooster is mine. Two votes for the for the blue rooster. All right, Sheila Najad. I'm gonna go classic, cherry in the spoon. All right, great answers, Alvi. Thank you so much for those questions.